Hello everyone, welcome back to Infigyan. Today in this video, we have another very very interesting question from algebraic equations. So let's get started straight away. I can write x cannot be equal to negative 1. We will get indeterminate form. Now I can see I can take 2 common from this bracket. So it will come out as 2 power 5, 2 common from here also, 2 common from here also. So I will write equation x plus 1 whole power 5. Then we can write 2 power 5 is 32 times x plus 1 whole power 5 over. I will take 2 power 5 as a coefficient times in the bracket we will get 2x plus 3 whole power 5 plus 2 power 5 I will write here. In the bracket we can write 3x plus 2 whole power 5. RHS is 3 over 800. Now this is 1 times. So 1 plus 32 is 33. So we can write 33 times x plus 1 whole power 5 in the numerator. In denominator this will become 2 power 5 is overall common. In bracket we can write 2x plus 3 whole power 5 plus 3x plus 2 whole power 5. In RHS it is 3 over 800. Now 2 power 5 we can write 32 in the denominator. Now I have to remove or get rid of 33 over 32 from the LHS. So I will multiply our equation by 32 over 33 both sides. 32 over 33 and this side also I will multiply with 32 over 33. Now I can cancel 33 from the LHS, 32 from the numerator denominator from LHS. So our equation we will get x plus 1 whole power 5 over 2x plus 3 whole power 5 plus 3x plus 2 whole power 5 and RHS will be 1 over 275 once we will simplify. We can cancel 3 and 33. We will be getting here 11. Now I can cancel 32 and 800. We will be getting 25. So 25 times 11 is 275. Let me write this equation here. But before that I will switch numerator and denominator from both the sides. So I can write our equation as 2x plus 3 whole power 5 plus 3x plus 2 whole power 5 over x plus 1 whole power 5. This will be equal to 275. Now I will split numerator with respect to denominator. So I can write 2x plus 3 over x plus 1 and then whole power 5 plus 3x plus 2 over x plus 1 whole power 5. RHS is 275. Now we will use substitutions. Let's say this bracket is A, this bracket is B. So I can write our first equation A power 5 plus B power 5 equal to 275. And second equation we will get once we will add A and B. So denominator is same. I will write x plus 1 as it is. Simply add the numerator written terms. So 2x plus 3 plus 3x plus 2. So this will come out 5x plus 5 
over x plus 1. Now I will take 5 common from the numerator and cancel x plus 1 from numerator denominator. We will get a plus b equal to 5. So I will say this is our equation 2. This is our equation 1. Now I will calculate a cube plus b cube also. So let me write a power 5 plus b power 5. This is equal to 275. And second equation was a plus b equal to 5. Now I will use algebraic formula a cube plus b cube which is equal to a plus b whole cube minus 3ab times a plus b. Let's put the values. I will write here the value of a plus b only. So 5 cube minus 3 times ab times 5. Let's take 5 common from this side. We will get 5 square at the first term position. So 25 minus 3ab. This is our equation number 3. And this is the value of a cube plus b cube. Now I will use binomial expansion. So I will write here a plus b whole power 5 direct formula we can write a power 5 plus b power 5 plus 5 ab times a cube plus b cube plus 10 a square b square times a plus b. Now we will use equation 1, 2 and 3. So I can write our equation as a plus b whole power 5. a plus b was 5. So I will write 5 power 5 in the LHS, RHS. a power 5 plus b power 5, 275 plus 5 times ab, a cube plus b cube. This is 5 times, let me write here, 5 times in the bracket, 25 minus 3ab. Then 10 times a square b square, a plus b is 5. So I can write directly 50a square b square. Now equation is divisible by 5. Let us divide by 5. Divided by 5. Divided by 5, divided by 5, divided by 5. So I can cancel this 5 with this power and it will be power 4 left. So 5 power 4 is 625 equal to 275 divided by 5. I can write the value 55 plus 5 and 5 will be over from here and we will cancel 50 over 5 this is 10 only. So I can write 5ab times 25 minus 3ab plus 10a square b square. Now I will take 55 to the LHS 625 minus 55 570. This will be equal to 5ab in the bracket 25 minus 3ab plus 10a square b square. Once we will simplify this equation, we will get one quadratic in ab. I will write directly a square b square minus 25ab plus 114 equal to 0. Now we can see the factors of 114. So I can write 19 times 6. And if I will add these two, I will get our middle term coefficient 25. So I will put minus sign before that. I will split minus 25 AB as minus 19 AB minus 6 AB plus 114 equal to 0. So from here we will be getting AB minus 6 
ए बी माइनस नाइनटीन इक्वल टू जीरो फ्रॉम प्रोडक्ट जीरो रूल वी विल गेट ए बी इक्वल टू सिक्स एंड ए बी इक्वल टू नाइनटीन नाउ आई विल राइट अवर सेकेंड इक्वेशन ए प्लस बी इक्वल टू फाइव फ्रॉम हेयर आई कैन राइट बी विल बी इक्वल टू फाइव माइनस ए लेट्स पुट ओवर हेयर ए टाइम्स फाइव माइनस ए इक्वल टू सिक्स एंड नाइनटीन और आई कैन राइट फाइव ए माइनस ए स्क्वायर इक्वल टू सिक्स और नाइनटीन so i will get two equations from here 5a minus a square equal to 6 or i can write quadratic as a square minus 5a plus 6 equal to 0 this is our first quadratic equation second equation would be 5a minus a square equal to 19 or i can write a square minus 5a plus 19 equal to 0 second quadratic equation let us solve our first equation first i will write a square minus 5a plus 6 equal to 0 now i can see the factors of 6 we can write 2 times 3 is 6 If I will add both, I will get five. So I can split our middle term minus five a as minus two a minus three a plus six equal to zero. A is common. A minus two in the bracket. Minus three will take common from here. A minus two will be in the bracket equal to zero. So I can take a minus two overall common. So in other bracket we can write. A minus three equal to zero. So from here we'll be getting a equal to two, a equal to three. Now a was our substitution. A was two x plus three over x plus one equal to two and three. So we can solve two equations. Let me write here. 2x plus 3 over x plus 1 equal to 2 and 2x plus 3 over x plus 1 equal to 3. Now we will cross multiply. We will write 2x plus 3. This will be equal to 2 times x plus 1 or 2x plus 2. Now 2x and 2x will be over. Three cannot be equal to two, so from this equation, we won't get any solution. I will write no solutions. Now we will solve second equation. Cross multiply once again. Two x plus three will be equal to three times x plus one or three x plus three. Now I will take two x to the RHS. Three and three will be over. So I can write x will be equal to zero. This is our first real solution. Now we will solve second quadratic equation a square minus five a plus nineteen equal to zero. Let me write here a square minus five a plus nineteen equal to zero. Let us apply quadratic formula. As per formula, minus b plus minus square root of b square minus 4ac divided by 2 times a. As per our equation, our a will be equal to 1, b will be equal to negative 5, c will be 19. So I will get the value of a. Minus of minus five plus five plus minus the square root of minus five whole square will be twenty five minus four times one times nineteen divided by two times one so two 
or we can write 5 plus minus the square root of 25 minus 76 over 2. This will be equal to 5 plus minus the square root of minus 51 it is over 2. Now we know that the square root of minus 1 is complex number i. So I can write here 5 plus minus i square root 51 over 2. This is the value of a. Let me write this value here. a equal to 5 plus minus i times square root 51 over 2. Now I will write the value of a, our substitution a. 2x plus 3 over x plus 1 equal to a. Cross multiply. I will get 2x plus 3. This will be equal to ax plus a. Or I can take 2x to the RHS. So I can write minus of a minus 3. This will be equal to a minus 2 times x. Or I can write the value of x in terms of a. This will be equal to minus of a minus 3 over a minus 2. Now this is a. Now I will write minus of a minus 3. So I will write in bracket 5 plus minus i square root 51 over 2 minus 3 over 5 plus minus i square root 51 over 2 minus 2. Now we will take LCM. We will get x equal to minus of 5 minus 6. So I will write minus 1 plus minus i root 51 over 2 that would be cancelled with the denominators denominator 2 and in the denominator 5 minus 4. So I will get 1 plus minus i root 51 only. Now we will rationalize our denominator and we will get our complex solutions. So let's multiply here with 1 minus plus i root 51. So in the denominator 1 minus plus i root 51. Once we will simplify our denominator, this will generate a plus b a minus b form. So we can utilize difference of two squares formula and in numerator if I will simplify and write then we will get minus in numerator's bracket I will write minus 1 plus minus i root 51 plus minus i root 51 plus 51. This is our numerator's bracket. In denominator, we will apply difference of two squares formula. So I can write 1 plus 51. i square is negative 1. Once we will simplify, we will get our complex solutions. Minus 25 over 26. Plus minus or minus plus. i square root 51 over 26. So we have three solutions. Two solutions are complex value and one is real that is x equal to 0. I hope friends you will like this video. Thank you so very much for watching. Do not forget to subscribe our channel. Bye bye till next video. Good luck. Take care.